Hi, I'm Melinda Elmer with Century 21 Masters and the Elmer team. Thanks so much for watching my video blog today. Today I'm talking a little bit about, as a follow-up to last week's video, and how to find money to help upgrade your home. So I had some questions that came up after my video about Hero and Pace loans and what those loans could be used for. So I thought I would address it on this week's video. So Hero and Pace loans are really meant to be for energy efficiency upgrades. So things like insulation to your home. Um, it can also be made for uh, upgrades to your windows, solar panels. Sometimes they'll do heating and air conditioning in the home and, and things like that that are meant to help make your home more energy efficient. Now each company is going to be a little bit dif different, but if you Google Hero or Paceleans, you'll find all sorts of companies that come up that will give you more specifics on that. Now that payment gets repaid by attaching it on your tax bill. So if your tax bill is at a certain amount, say you're paying $3,000 and you do a bunch of upgrades, then your tax bill is going to increase on a monthly or yearly amount. And that may also get impounded in your mortgage payment. So just be aware that that's going to happen. Another option that you can do is that you can do a cash out refinance of your home. Now the interest rates have been rising. So if you have a really great interest rate, pretty much anything under 4%, you may not want to look at that as an option uh, because the interest rates have been rising and a cash out refinance may be at a higher interest rate, which may cost you a lot more in the long run. Now, another option that you can do with, your, with a mortgage is a home equity line of credit. Now, this leaves your initial mortgage intact and allows you to pull some money from the home and repay that uh, as quickly as you would like. So that is generally, again, at a higher interest rate than your first loan because it's in a second position, um, but you may still be able to get a decent interest rate on that home equity line of credit. Now, the good news is about, about a cash out refinance or a home equity line of credit, if you are doing significant improvements to your home, you may still be able to write off the mortgage interest on that. Now, if you're pulling the money out just to do uh, debt consolidation, things like that, you cannot write off the mortgage interest on those for those reasons, but you can for significant improvements. And of course, if you have any other questions or you want any more specific details about this or referrals to some great lenders, give me a call. My number is 562-316-2915 or you can reach me at melinda at theelmerteam.com. Thanks so much for watching.